Hello everybody, my name is Alphanel and welcome back to Psychonauts. Will I get in trouble with Mia? She told me not to take any paranormal training while I'm here. Step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready. Okay. Could you try it first? Step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready. Will I get in trouble with Mia? She told me not to take any paranormal training. Could you try it first? Step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready. So, what's this hairdryer thing do? Ah, you're ready for the brain tumbler. With this device, we will send you deep into your own psyche, where you should find unparalleled insight and power. Excellent! Tumble away! Now just relax. This will not hurt. Unless something really very bad happens. Wow! Is this what the inside of my mind looks like? Not yet. You're still traveling to the astral plane. This is a tiny corner of what we call the collective unconscious, a place in which all of our unconscious minds are connected. You have just begun your training, Rasputin, so many of the connections with other minds are still not developed for you, and those doorways remain just out of reach. But the more you explore the mental world, the more connections you will form. Right now, the only unconscious world you can enter is that one, your own. Step through it, and we'll continue. Yep. What happens if I fall off? Oh, I'm not allowed to. Your name here. Hmm. Rasputin, can you hear me? Sasha? Where am I? You are inside your own mind. But I'm not sure where. Tell me, what can you see? I see a rundown gypsy caravan. Do you recognize it? Yes. It's where I was born. I see. Compelling. Rasputin's getaway. World's smallest pony. Sasha, I'm going inside the caravan. What do you see inside? I'm not sure. It's getting fuzzy. Uh-oh. What? No, I'll figure it out. Rasputin, tell me what is happening. Well, I'm kind of stuck in a little white space. Hmm. How little? Really little. Do you feel trapped? No. Confined? No. Smothered like you're buried alive? No! Ah! Get me out of here! Can you find your way out? I can't see anything. Can you fight your way out? Huh? Strike out with your psychic fist, Rasputin, but carefully. Aha! Uh -huh. 
Rasputin, are you okay? What do you see now? I see a small, bunny-like animal thing. Hmm. An unfamiliar animal entity in a dream often represents a primal fear or memory. Follow it and it should lead you somewhere important. Check. Okay, Mr. Bun. You and I are gonna be tight. Wherever you go, I go. Like two peas in a... Hey! Come back here! Sasha? What is it? Another bunny? No. This is more of a super scary flaming eyed demon kind of deal. Oh. Hmm. What? Okay, I'm pulling you out of there. Just give me a second. Uh, Sasha? Hold on, I'm still getting some unusual interference. It's fascinating. As if someone else. Was... Agent 9? Sorry. Almost ready. Sasha! Ah! Hmm. That should not have happened. We need to try that again. Oh, I don't think I need to be in the tumbler with the glowy eye guys anymore. Suit yourself. You know, in many tribal societies, learning to defeat the monsters you see in your dreams is considered a rite of passage. I can train you to fight. Come see me when you're ready. Missing a scavenger hunt item. Would you like me to take you, Agent Kralik? <laughs> Nowhere. I just like to come down here to hear your voice. Pop in any time, sir. Here's that item that I want.
I don't think I read this when I got it, so I'll do it again. Eagle Claw Soup is surprisingly tanging in. Promotes the growth of strong fingernails. Okay. Fossil. Bringing day-old chicken pot pie from the cafeteria doesn't count. I've been fooled thrice already, but from now on, you kids better have the real McCoy. Hmm. Okay, I'm ready to learn how to really fight. Oh, really? Hmm. What? Oh, uh, nothing. It's just that I didn't think you'd really take me up on that offer. It usually scares the kids off. Well, not me. I'm ready to kill for my camp. Listen, I'm sorry, but I can't train you. Agent Vodello would kill me. What's the big deal? What she doesn't know won't hurt her. You don't even have a marksmanship learner's permit. I could lose my job. I'll get one. Even if you used that secret passage over there and snuck into his sanctuary, Agent Crawler would never give you a marksmanship learner's permit. Agent Crawler? Never in a million... I'm off. Be right back after I talk with Agent Crawler. Be right back. Where would you like me, Crawler? Let's go to Ford's... I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, noble psycho master. Agent Crawler? Job, how goes the training? Sasha says I need to learn how to fight better. You want to teach you advanced combat? On your first day? Yeah. I had a vision with a huge monster with yellow eyes and a big mouth full of gnashing teeth. Did it happen to spit anything at you? Yeah. I think it was like an old dining helmet or something. I see. Hmm. Yes, well, we'd better get you armed. Why? What's happening? Oh, nothing, nothing. P prepare your mind. That's the motto of the Psychonauts. <clears throat> Here, this is a marksmanship learner's permit. It will only work when you're in Sash's mind. Once you complete his shooting range, you'll get the real merit badge and you can side blast any way you want. Thanks. Side blast? Oh, you'll find out. Now get going. We can't have the camp overrun with big-eyed garbage spitting monsters, can we? No, sir. I'd better go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? Agent Nine's lab, please. With pleasure. Okay, I got it. Check it out. Excellent. Well, my ass is covered. Are you sure you are ready to do this? It could be dangerous. Almost. I just have to get my affairs in order first, just in case I die. Come back when you are ready. Okay, I'm ready to learn how to really fight. Are you sure you are ready to do this? It could be dangerous. Yes. Are you gonna pull me into your mind like the coach did? <laughs> no offense, but it's time you saw what an organized mind looks like. Welcome to my mind. Huh. It's so empty. Uh, I mean... There's more here than meets the eye, but I've learned to keep it under strict control, and that's what I'm going to teach you. Control your feelings, your fears, your anger. You must learn to control them, focus them, concentrate them, and release them. As therapy? No, as firepower. 
Say something hideous and horrible jumps out at you. Something so disgusting that it simply must die. Ah, oh, so tacky. I can't look directly at it. But I control those feelings. Focus them, concentrate, and release. And the world is a better place. Your turn. Well done, Raz. Keep shooting. Well done, Raz. Keep shooting. Excellent. A victory for good taste. Now you must strive for precision when targeting. Say you were set upon by multiple attackers. But you need to dispense with them in a certain order. Eliminate these monsters in the proper sequence and we can move on to the next lesson. What happens if we mess up? Good shooting, Raz, but you are making it harder than it needs to be. You need to practice locking your mental focus. It makes targeting and evasive maneuvers much easier. Let's try again. This time, lock your mental focus. Again. Good. Again. Now then. No. Is this what you saw in your vision? No. Um, well, it sure seemed a lot bigger in my head. No. Ah, problems often seem larger in our heads than they really are. That's an important lesson to learn. But... This is a sensor, no. an integral part of any sane person's mind. The sensors roam through your psyche looking for thoughts that don't belong. Hallucinations, manias, waking dreams. The sensors hunt them down and censor them out. Why do they come after me? I'm not a mania. Yes, but you are a foreign entity in my mind. You technically don't belong here. Yes, but I was attacked in my own head. Yes, well, the brain tumbler could be malfunctioning, or you could be insane. We'll test for that later. For now, <laughs> blast it. That's the spirit. I killed it. It was just a thought I was having, and it's not dead. It has just returned to its basic form, raw psychic energy. Go absorb it. It's good for your mental health. <laughs> as you absorb this energy, your mental health increases. But as you psi blast, you expend your will to do damage. So be on the lookout for these small, dense clusters of raw psychic aggression. Absorb these as well to make sure you always have enough firepower. Now I'll leave the machine on for you, so you can practice. You have to blast 1,000 sensors to earn your marksmanship merit badge. Come back every day for practice, and you should have enough in as little as... three weeks. Three weeks? I only have a few days to earn all my merit badges and become a psychonaut. Slow and steady wins the race, my eager young friend. Now practice, slowly and carefully. Oh, man. This is going to take forever. I wonder if I can speed it up somehow.
This is gonna take forever. I wonder if I can speed it up somehow. enough. to Papa. Raz, what have you done? This is not control. This is chaos. I'll try to fix it. You stay here and keep the numbers under control. Those valves, that is where the sensors are leaking out. Psi blast the valves to shut them down and get this area under control. Cobweb trouble? The camp store sells this handy device for removing pesky mental cobwebs. Buy your cobweb duster today. This guy needs a duffel bag tag. This guy needs a duffel bag tag. Watch it! 
Sasha's first laws. Oh. One leak down and another springs up. Well, come on, we've got to take care of these too. Oh, that one's bigger.
lose all of your mental health, you peel off a layer of your astral projection. If you lose all the layers, then you will no longer be able to maintain a projection in the mental world, and you'll be kicked out into the real world. Collect markers like this to replace layers, and collect markers like this to increase how many layers you can maintain at once. Thank <laughs> you. 
I don't know how I can get to these parts. You have learned a lesson here today. Yes, I have. That shooting things is fun and useful. No, that once you lose control of your own mind, it's very hard to get it back. Yes, one's thoughts must be 100% controlled at all times. Well, no. Actually, if you try to completely suppress your undesirable feelings, they'll build and build and eventually explode. Oh, so, uh, 
What would happen if you were to, say, completely block off all your sensor outlets? Well, there would be a buildup of sensor energy within that would, uh, eventually... Run, Rasputin. Very fast. Oops. You are my own creation. I command you to stop. Rasputin, it's time to earn your merit badge! When your mental focus is on, press A and use the arrow keys or left joystick in any direction. Very useful for circling your enemy. Defeat the Mega Sensor. Enough horseplay, Rasputin. Destroy him! Is this where I get a speech and learn another lesson? No. Here's your merit badge. Let us never speak of this again. I got my marksmanship merit badge. To shoot more things. Okay, okay, enough about my mind. Let's stay out of my mind for a while. Let's just go back into yours, huh? Step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready. to return to the brain tumbler right now but we're gonna have to do that in the next episode